We come from very fast, different backgrounds. We have all our own challenges, but somehow the challenges are the same. It's quite challenging at times um, when we have men being seen as um, superiors in the community and we're proving that we're capable of doing what men can do. A lot of the weaknesses that I, well, I perceive were weaknesses are actually strengths that I can use in my role as a leader in the community. The reason why I'm here is because I wanted to hone my leadership skills and when I was told about this initiative by Cricket Australia and Netball Australia, together with the ICC, I was quite excited about the fact that if I can come and learn just a little bit more, there's one missing puzzle in this journey of mine as far as leadership and sports development is concerned, and I felt this is where I'm going to find the answers. That's why I'm here. When I came here, I met this wonderful woman who kind of included me into their family. And this was a place where I could be myself. My views were counted, whatever I said mattered. So it was like a family. They got us to go to a very deep level conversant. And um, I thought I was pretty reflective already. I thought I knew myself pretty well, but they were peeling back layers I never thought existed and even made me cry. I came in this week, you know, just to join a, a, a leadership conference with women. I'm about to walk away um, having met a whole bunch of new sisters from the Pacific. My network is stronger. I have a lot of people in the room where my weakness is their strength. So I have so much to take away and um, I'm very thankful for the Government of Australia for believing in uh, Olivia and, and Jane and this initiative. And I hope that many women after us can, can benefit from this um, initiative. I wanted to see what everybody was like and when we started introducing ourselves we had a lot of women who were outspoken, they were all very noisy. So I thought, oh yeah, that's the group I wanted to be in and yeah, it was so much fun and for me it's, I've learned so much and also my self-awareness, you know, I've brought myself right out and I dug deep in me to find the real me and it was good. I looked at the leadership style. I've learned that uh, how I've been managing, it's direct. I'm not looking you know, out of the box and uh, taking responsible risks. So from this course, I know I can do this. I, I have to learn to take risks. The, the activities we did, like two words, effective and efficient. Am I just efficient because I want to please my boss and I want people under me to see me? Or is what I'm doing effective? One of the standout moments was uh, our trip to the Golden City. My expectation was that we were going to go to some beachside village and uh, there'd be like a nice green field. And what I actually saw was that it was just a road, dusty road, and joy in the, the kids' faces and that seeing their, their love of the game their enthusiasm, regardless of their surroundings. One of the girls said that they wanted to play netball and that she wanted to represent PNG one day. And she just, it was just that joy in her face and the possibilities. I um, mean, often as adults, we forget about those possibilities. You know, we forget that as children, we had those dreams and, and that there were no barriers. I learned so much. Each and every woman here were true inspiration for me. I'm taking at least one thing from each and every one of them.
It's just blowing my mind, the things that I've learned. And the one thing that I will definitely start practicing as soon as I get home is their um, having more um, quality conversations and the framework that they gave us to, to do that. I talk a lot, I love talking, but I never realised that a lot of those conversations were not really quality conversations where I was listening to learn. For myself, the highlight would be getting to meet all these people, networking here, yeah, just to have that um, relationship with them and build it, um, networking with them. So um, going back to my organization, if I stumble or if I face an obstacle, you know, there's always someone I can talk to for help and advice and someone I can connect to, yeah. I feel a lot of self-awareness. I'm more confident, I have a purpose. I know when I land, my flight lands, and I step off the plane, I know exactly where I'm going, I know exactly what I'm doing. It's awesome to be amongst all the like-minded ladies. Together we're a powerhouse. We're a powerhouse. Seeing the energy, the love, the emotional moments that we share, I know we can do something great for the Pacific.